All right, so let's look at this. We have a, a mixture problem. It says how many liters of a 10% alcohol solution should be mixed with 12 liters of a 20% alcohol solution to obtain a 14% alcohol solution. All right, so to uh, start this off, what we're going to do is let's draw some buckets here. All right, so we've got a bucket that has a 10% alcohol solution, and we have another bu bucket that has 20% alcohol solution, and the total we want a 14% alcohol solution. So we want to know how many liters of a 10% alcohol solution. So the number of liters in the 10% solution would be X. Okay. Should be mixed with 12 liters of a 20% alcohol solution. So the number of liters here in the 20% is 12 to obtain a 14% alcohol solution. All right, so what do we need to put in this last bucket? Well, we're going to take this bucket and we're going to dump it into this one and we're going to take this bucket and dump it into this one. So the number of liters we have here is X liters plus 12 liters. So that would be X plus 12. All right. So now our variable X is the number of liters. X is the number of liters of a 10% alcohol solution. That's what we're looking for. Now let's set up our equation. So we've got 10% of X liters. So that's going to be 0.1 times X. We change the 10% to a decimal plus 20% alcohol of 12 liters so that's 0.2 times 12 and then we have 14 percent of the total so that's going to be 0.14 times x plus 12. All right so to solve this the best way is to uh, get rid of the decimals. So you can see here the decimal needs to be moved one place. Here it needs to be moved one place. But here it needs to be moved two places to the right to get rid of the decimal. So if we multiply something by 10, it moves the decimal one place to the right. If we multiply it by 100, it moves it two places to the right. If we multiply it by a thousand, it, multi it moves the decimal three places to the right, and so on. So what we're going to do is we're going to multiply each term by a hundred, because the most we need to move the decimal place is twice. So I've got a hundred times 0.1x plus a hundred times 0.2 times 12 equals 100 times 0.14 times x plus 12. All right, so we got 100 times 0.1. That moves the decimal two places to the right. So that's going to be 10x plus 
Move the decimal two places to the right. That's 20 times 12. Now, when we multiply the 100 times this, we multiply 100 times 0.2, which gives us 20, and then 20 times 12. Make sure that you're not multiplying 100 times 0.2 and then 100 times 12. You don't do that. And then we multiply the 100 here. That moves the decimal two places to the right. So that's 14 times x plus 12. And once again, you multiply the 100 times the 0.14, which gives you 14. And then you distribute the 14. You don't multiply the 100 times the 0.14 and then the 100 times x times 12. Make sure you don't do that. All right, so let's see what we get. We get 10x plus 240 equals 14x plus, and then let's see, 14 times 12 is going to be 168. And now we, we just solve for x. So I'm going to subtract 240 to both sides. And I'm going to subtract 14x to both sides. And so this is going to give me negative 4x equals negative 72 and then I divide both sides by negative 4 and so I get x equals 18 and that that would be 18 liters and that's my answer 18 liters of the 10 percent alcohol solution I hope this video helped. Uh, I'm going to post some more videos of these mixture problems. Thanks.